Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. So today I'm doing a Motel Rocks video part two. I have actually done a part one so if you want to check that out I will put that somewhere above but I kind of wanted to give them another chance because in my first video I was a bit kind of disappointed with the items and I thought okay let's just give it another shot try some different clothes and see if it was just a bad batch. Motel Rocks is no lie they're expensive. I do a 25% discount which I think is like permanent but it's still quite pricey for what you get so if you do like the video and haven't already I would really appreciate you liking commenting and subscribing and click the bell so you're notified every single time I post and without further ado let's get straight into the video. Okay, so I paired this really cute crop top that says angel energy on it with these kind of infamous angel bottoms like I feel like when you go on the insta section which is kind of things that people tend to wear on my like instagram they are always in that section and I always see it on the cover for Motel Rocks and it was meant to be paired with a sweatshirt that matched it but they had sold out and I was so upset because it would have gone so perfectly it matched and it was just a whole set but I will say the bottoms are so expensive like I'll put the price here I just would not pay that for joggers despite them fitting so beautifully so the waistband is quite tight so it does really cinch you in along with the cuffs at the bottom so they fit true to size and they're really flattering but I still would not pay that much money for them unfortunately sorry Motel Rocks but the whole outfit together was an absolute vibe loved it so as you can see this is a strappy dress and it's got some kind of dragon details on it and I don't know if I like this one because it didn't have much shape at all to it and it was kind of like weirdly oversized and quite square when you look at the shape it wasn't that flattering but obviously if you were to like cinch it in with a belt like you'll see me do it wasn't too bad um it just seemed like it was massive compared to like the size that it was and the back was really low which I actually really liked about that that was like the best part of it um but I have also paired it with a white t-shirt which isn't from Motel Rocks so I didn't really find any that would work for that and I feel like now absolutely yes I don't like this dress at all. I feel like it just didn't flatter me. It didn't look good on me. Again, the, the models just make it look so good and like so aesthetic. Or when you put it on yourself, you're just like, oh my God, I look like a potato in a dress. You guys might think I'm overreacting, but I just was not vibing with this dress at all. I don't like the colors of it. I don't even know why I got it in the first place. I just, I think it's quite low down here as well. Like I felt like I was gonna have a bit of a slip. There wasn't much shape. It seemed really oversized for what it was. And I just, I just didn't really like it. It wasn't awful obviously, but I feel like it's not my style to begin with and the shape was just kind of a letdown for me, so I will not be keeping this piece whatsoever. Unfortunately, I don't have the energy to put on the polka dot top again because I really struggled. Although it is my size, it was just so hard to get my arms through and as you can see in the video, I couldn't actually zip it up, which was a major problem. I don't like to have to stress about how to get in and out of a top, so for practicality reasons, I won't be keeping, which is such a shame because it's honestly a beautiful top. Absolutely loved it. It's so sophisticated. You can wear it with the jeans, um, skirt, anything like that. So it was such a letdown that practically it was not very good. So this is a shirt dress with this kind of bandana print on it. Um, it was quite oversized, but I felt like the sizing was fine. It didn't have shape to it, but obviously I wouldn't expect it to because it is oversized. Um, it was okay, I wasn't in love with it. I feel like the models on the website pulled it off a lot better than I did, unfortunately. But I did decide to pair it with a belt because I like having a bit more shape even with oversized things and I feel like this brought it together so nicely and I'd definitely wear this out with like some white chunky trainers or maybe even some boots. I know it's the wrong season, but yeah, it wasn't too bad. So here we have a black top and a checkered skirt. Um, I really like the top actually, it's pretty cute and off it looked literally like a child's top, it looked tiny but I had no issue stretching it over my head or getting my arms through which was a nice surprise. Um, regarding the skirt it was a bit too, I don't know if I'd say too big but because it wasn't elasticated it doesn't really work for my figure so I did have a gap at the back of it and I had to wear it really low down which isn't something I really go for and then I did decide to button up the top to show you what it looks like done up and I think I prefer it undone personally but it's nice that you can choose either style so. So now we have a black cute skirt obviously paired with the same top. This is the one thing that I actually really liked out of everything and obviously the joggers. Um, I just thought it fit really well for once. It was elasticated so obviously that worked in my favour. Um, it was two layers so the top layer had like the floral on and then it was just black underneath but I found it so cute and they actually do it in white so if you are interested you can check out the white one on their website but like with everything else the price thing I just can't justify it so although it was very cute I just don't see it being that much value for money. 
Thank you so much for watching my video and hopefully this has helped you decide whether you want to actually purchase from Motile Rocks or not because I know a lot of people are interested but they're not really sure. So yeah, if you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thank you.